the shoe felt fantastic as I sped up. Hey guys, today we're reviewing the Adidas Ultra Boost 20. I really like the shoe and I'm excited to tell you about it. So first things first, I've got about 15 miles in the shoe so far. I got to test it a little bit early, really excited. Uh, as some of you know, I'm coming off of my first 100 mile race. My legs have been pretty beat up. My feet have been pretty beat up and uh, this was kind of a godsend to have this as my, uh, as my next shoe. So uh, a few things. So right off the bat, what I noticed in this shoe was the energy return. So again, my legs are beat up right now. So having that energy return in the midsole, every step I took, um, you could kind of feel that springiness uh, here in the shoe and that helped a whole, a whole lot. Uh, my legs definitely didn't feel as beat up uh, as they have been at the end of my run uh, and I'm running every day. So uh, getting to run in this shoe was definitely um, a nice break from some of the other shoes I've been running in. A couple things uh, around the midsole of the shoe and the energy return that I would uh, certainly call out. So my last run in the shoe was about seven and a half miles. It was just a few days ago. And uh, the first 45 minutes of the run, I was running uh, on the slower side uh, for me. So, you know, taking it kind of easy. And during that time, during that 45 minutes, the shoe did feel a little bit heavier. Uh, this shoe, the uh, men's version, weighs out at about 11 ounces. Um, as I, and in the last 15 minutes, I, uh, I consciously sped up. I was planning to run the first, last 15 minutes faster than the first 45 minutes. Uh, and the shoe felt fantastic as I sped up. So even though the shoe is a little bit on the heavier side, I loved the responsiveness, the energy return, um, the heel to forefoot transition in the shoe. All of those things were really, really good. Uh, especially I could feel them as I sped up. So for me, I'm thinking this isn't necessarily my my long distance training shoe as as opposed to my my six to, for me like middle distance six to eight mile runs nine mile runs something in there on days where number one i want to save my legs a little bit and two i'm not looking to use this as like a track workout speed shoe but on days where i do want to maybe pick it up a couple times during uh during my run i think this is a really good option a couple other things i would uh, call out with the shoe definitely um very, uh, very airy. I felt like uh, the, uh, the 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 flow in the shoe was, as far as like airflow in the shoe, was really good. They use this Prime Knit Plus upper in the shoe, and so as I was running, um, my feet never got overheated or warm. That worked really well, and it also hugged my foot really well. So I always felt secure in the shoe. Um, where not overly secure, where. Uh, I felt like it was constricting or I was going to get any hot spots or anything, but it felt locked in and that was really nice. The midfoot of the shoe also had that really nice locked in feel, so that was good. In the heel, I know they've taken some, uh, some of the uh, technology out of the heel as far as the, the upper fit of the heel here, but they've added in actually more, more padding and cushioning. And that for me worked really well. It felt locked in, but it also felt really comfortable, especially as I was taking turns. Um, this felt good. I didn't have any weird rubbing or hot spots. And after my 100 mile race, I had uh, a couple issues in the heel. This was actually a shoe that I, those issues I didn't feel, which again, really, really good for me. Um, overall, I think if you were somebody that liked the Ultra Boost 19, the 20 is going to be a great shoe for you. Um, I really like it. It definitely has a place in my rotation now. And uh, again, I, th I think you'll like it a lot as well. So if you're VIP, remember you get 90 days to test run any, uh, any of our shoes. So make sure that we can make sure this is the right one for you. If it's not, bring it on back. We'll get you something that is. And if uh, also if you're VIP and shopping online, free shipping for VIP. So keep that in mind. Give this one a try. I think you're really gonna like it. And we'll see you on the road.